right, so let's jump right into it. So Young Thug's motion for a mistrial and his long-running RICO trial has been denied by Judge Paige Reese Whitaker. While that is a setback for the YSO rapper, Whitaker also slammed the prosecution for how they are presenting their case against Thugga, who they accuse of being the head of a criminal street gang. Now, in a moment of frustration, captured on a court's live stream, Whitaker admonished prosecutor saying, I don't want to malign a prosecutor standing in front of me right now, so I'm not gonna say the possible things it could be. But it is baffling to me that somebody with the number of years of experience that you have time after time after time continues to seemingly and purposefully hide the ball to the extent you possibly can for as long as you possibly can. Now, I really don't believe that it is purposeful, but honestly, after a certain number of times, you start to wonder how it could be anything but that. Unless it is just that you're just so unorganized that you're throwing this case together as you try it. She also added, this case is being made much more difficult for everybody because of the haphazard way that is being presented. Now, Whitaker then called a brief recess and retreated to her quarters to consider the mistrial motion, but decided against it, okay? Now, Young Thug's Rico trial is the longest running courtroom saga in Georgia state history and has seen no shortage of drama since it began in November. November 2023. Now, most of the trial's most remarkable moments have revolved around key witness Kenneth Lil Woody Copeland, who was granted immunity by the prosecution for his testimony. He previously told the court that he had been a prolific liar, saying, like I told you before, y'all call me to trial, I have lied. I made things up. I told you this before. Y'all brought me in this courtroom, and I'm telling you now. You asked me about 2015. I had got my life together. You're trying to put this on my conscience. You're trying to put people's lives in my hands. Now, he also continued, I don't want to be here. Y'all have pressured me. I'm tired of y'all because y'all know y'all doing wrong, and y'all black people doing this to us. Copeland also fired his own attorney while on the stand. OMG, listen, this has been going on for some time now. This trial started in November of 2023. We're almost hitting a year, okay? So jump in the comments. Let me let me know. What do you think about this? Do you think that Young Thug, Thugger, is going to walk away from this unscathed? Or do you think that he's going to do time? Jump in the comments. Let me know what you think about this. What do you think about the judge? having a mini meltdown and tired of all the drama and the nonsense jump in the comments let me know what you think about that if you're new here welcome and as always if you like what you hear you know what to do like share and subscribe ciao